everybody welcome back to another video in this one I'm going to be cleaning my cockatiel's cage um, it's pretty messy right now I haven't cleaned it in a while on purpose just so I could show me cleaning it and I'm gonna be adding different sticks because those ones have like poo from that thing on it so yeah if you do enjoy this video please do drop a like subscribe if you're new I would appreciate it a lot anyways let's get straight into it floppy Okay, so I'm going to put the phone on top of the cage and like let it record because she whistles when I bring her outside, so I'm going to try to do that. Okay, wait, I'm going to try to put it to where it's on her and you can see her a little bit. <laughs> I have the phone on top of the cage, so it's a little weird. But I do want to hear you whistle if she does whistle when I bring her outside. Hopefully she does, hopefully you didn't see me either. And the phone moved a little bit, that's great. That looks really weird. I'm, hi! I'm watching the phone recording. Come on. There you go, she's whistling. Do it more. Alright, that's good enough. Bet. Oh. Oops. Okay. So that was, that was harder than I expected. Not harder, but it took longer than I expected. We brought her outside. I'll get going on the cleaning, but let me go close my door. So yeah, you heard her whistle. Well, actually, I keep saying her, and I'm pretty sure it's a male, which is weird because all my time I've been thinking it's a female, but it's a male, so I don't even know. So I'm going to start cleaning it. I'm going to start with the bottom of the cage first, and then I'm going to work to the sticks. And I'm thinking of leaving this one in because it's not really dirty. So let's get straight into it. There we go. I can see better on my phone now. Um, so there is just random stuff inside of here. Mostly seeds and sticks and stuff like that. So let's go dump this. We'll go. I just dump it in the dirt, honestly. I don't... It's not like it's gonna hurt the dirt. Okay, so what I do is I get a stick. I know, I know, that's a lot left over. I get a stick and I just scrape it off. I know people put like paper towels or napkins and stuff under it, but I'm just gonna do it the hard way. There's so many mosquitoes outside. I hope I don't get malaria. So I found this shell. <laughs> I'm gonna use it to just scrape this off. I know people are like, oh, you should use um, napkins or newspapers or stuff like that at the bottom of it so it's easier to clean, but I kind of like having something to do, so, yep, okay, so, I know this is not clean, Jesus Christ, okay, you know what, since this is me, okay, sorry if the camera flipped in a weird way, I know this is a video of, you know, we're going to clean this more, because I don't like that. I'm going to turn on water. Okay, so, I forgot that my house water was turned off, so we're going to have to do with this. What I am going to do is I'm going to scrape a little bit more off, and I'll be back. Okay, I know it doesn't, it probably doesn't look that much better, but... I'll clean, I'll clean it when I can, when I have water on. So, now that we have this part basically done, don't freak out, please. All I want to do is put this, this back in the bottom. Where are you? I'm going to try to record her while I do this. She does freak out a little bit because it's a whole big thing moving, but oh well. So next, I'm going to take out this big stick that goes like that because it has a lot of her poo on it, so... Let's take that out. You're good, right? Watch out. <laughs> okay. I'm going to do this without recording it because recording it is like too much at once. So as you can see, there's bird poo on this one and the small one. So I'm going to throw those away. I have these to choose from. So I'm going to look through all these, see which one I want to put in there, and then I'll be back. Okay. So, I don't know if I'm going to put this in because I don't know if there's going to be room for it. So I chose those two sticks because they're different from each other. And if I find a place for this big one, I'll put it in there. And like I said, I'm going to leave that thin one in there. 
Yeah. What? I was just about to say there's her playing with her toy, but no, she just threw it on the floor. Also, that's like tree bark, and she likes to bite that and mess with it, so I'm going to leave that in there, and there's no poo on it. Um, there is some... Like, if, if we look, there's some bird poo on the, um... On the floor of the place, but I'll clean all that later. I'm just going to try to make a quick video. I was going to make it where I cleaned more, but since I don't have water on right now, I'll do that for a different video. So let me get the sticks in there, and I'll see what's... Oh, she's playing with that little thing. T she heard a bird. Okay. Okay, so I know this may look crazy with all the different sticks, and they kind of look like they're standing straight up. I put them at an angle so they're not standing straight up. I'm going to see if she likes the sticks. I'll probably end up moving them around, but I can't I can't be out here anymore. My arm's getting bit up. You can't even see it. My arm's getting bit up. There's too many mosquitoes. All I'm thinking about is getting malaria from this, <laughs> and it's not good. Um, I am going to bring my bird inside, too, because mosquitoes can get birds, and... That's not a good thing. So, this bird cage is cleaner than it was before. There's new sticks. I'm going to end up putting that stick probably more towards the corner of it. So that way she could get on it more. I did put that big stick in so she could go up and down. Oh, she bit it. See, that's why I like adding new sticks too. Because she likes to bite the bark off of it. Or she likes to just tear it into pieces. and Stuff like that. So... As you can see, she is already enjoying it. I don't know if you're going to be seeing this. Okay, so the day I recorded this, you're going to see it the day after. So I'm, there might be a different intro. I don't even know. By the time you see this, it's already going to be happening. Anyways, if you enjoyed this video, please do drop a like, comment, and subscribe. I'd appreciate it a lot. I have more video ideas in the future. So, yeah. Anyways, I'll be seeing you guys soon. Wait, wait, wait. There's one more person. Floppy! I had, I had to say hi to Floppy before the video ended. He needs a million views on YouTube. So everyone will watch this video twice. Uh, I'm just kidding. If you enjoyed this video, please do drop a like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys soon in a week or two. See you. Peace.